with soup. Okay. Let me see. Where did you um? Where did you take it from? Oh, oh, Eva. I mean, I wasn't upset about it because you know they're little kids, and it wasn't a big deal for us because she lost her hair several times. Eva was diagnosed when she was eight months old with ALL acute lymphoblastic leukemia. The next day they put her on chemotherapy immediately. After a few months of chemo, she went into remission, but then the cancer came back and that kind of went on for a while. They told us, you know, we can give her the most heavy chemotherapy there is, but it's going to come back no matter what because the leukemia she has is very strong. But shortly after, we heard about this treatment called the CAR T cell therapy, which was a uh, clinical trial. And she was one of the first, I want to say like within the 200 patients to get this treatment. And it's been working ever since. Like she is in remission. And it's going to be five years this summer. And she's been doing great since. Go, go. Eva just has like a very strong attitude. She's very positive. Throughout her fight, she has been just like a little warrior. Her doctors were always like, you know, it's her little attitude that's getting her through this treatment because she doesn't give up. Are you happy to be back? You are? <laughs> you want to get better? Yeah. Let's kick butt? Yeah. Woohoo! I did see some people were like, how did you not freak out? Going through her fight with cancer, like it does make you realize that like, so there's some things in life that really don't matter. Like I said, you, you appreciate the little things, you know, and it was just like a good memory for us now as a family. Something that we have um, about Eva. Let's wrap the Before we start, hit the white button and see you next time. So before we do that, subscribe to our channel. If you click it, if you subscribe,